In this video, we're going to compare four different AI chatbots and see how they perform with Blender Python scripting. We're going to use three different example prompts and see how the different chatbots perform. And for this comparison, we're going to use Cloud, Gemini, ChatGPT, and Microsoft Copilot. So uh, here we have the code. So let's try Cloud first. Go into scripting. I'm going to delete everything in the viewport. And when we paste in the code and run it, you can see that we have some cubes, but uh, no cubes with actual vertices. Just a bunch of points. So I would say that Cloud failed for uh, this task. Next, we have a Gemini from Google. So let's paste it in and see what happens. And it failed, which is not very impressive considering that I have beginner tutorial on how to write that exact code. So it's very simple. And as you can see, it works with uh, ChatGPT. All of these are, of course, the free versions. And Microsoft Copilot, which is based on uh, GPT-4, also did the job well. I don't know why it set the interval from 0 to 10 instead of minus 10 to 10 like the other axis, but I never specified the distribution range, so I would say it was a success. Next, we can try to make a pyramid using cubes. So let's paste this prompt into all of the different chatbots. So let's see how the Claude chatbots performs. Let's paste in the code, run it, and I would say that that was a failure. Next, we can try out Gemini. And I would say that was a failure as well. And then GPT, definitely a failure. And then uh, Copilot, also failed. But I would say Copilot was the closest to the goal. When I made a similar video 10 months ago, Copilot actually managed to make a proper 3D pyramid. So I guess the output of the chatbots does not always improve. But uh, let's take a look at the next prompt. And that is going to be uh, to create an add-on, which adds a bunch of cubes in the shape of a heart. So uh, let's take a look at the Claude add-on first. So let's paste it in, run it, and as you can see, it failed. Next, we can try out Gemini. and see if that works. Okay, so it run and we go into the add-on, you can see that we got an add-on, but it does not actually do anything. So I would say that was a failure. I'm just going to restart Blender. And then next we can try out ChatGPT. And we did not get anything. So I would say that was a failure. It was supposed to be in the side panel. And then for Copilot, we need to join these two scripts together so that we get the full add-on, which is inconvenient, but uh, let's see if it works. And when we paste in the Copilot script, you can see that it failed as well. So as for the results, it was only ChatGPT and Copilot that had any success with the first prompt and then they all failed for the second and the third prompts. Using chatbots for scripting in Blender using Python is still very inefficient and with a lot of bugs. And uh, we haven't really seen any improvements since I did a video on this 10 months ago. When I used these chatbots for uh, programming with SQL, just basic Python and other languages, I have much more success. So I think the source of this problem it's just a lack of training data for uh, Blender scripting.